Hi y'all, how's everybody doing today? Uh, you know what, I just realized, I think I open with that exact saying every time I turn on a video. I don't know, that just hit me. So I am making a flip-flop journal today and I have put it together. I think you guys know how, I have a video um, on how to put it together. And so does Leslie, the wonderful Leslie from 507 Willow House that invented the flip-flop journal. She also has videos on, on putting it together. So I went ahead and put it together. I, um, I wanted to do a video yesterday um, which would have, you know, been constructing it and putting the pages together. But I was printing all the papers that, you know, the digitals that I want to use. And um, it took all day and into the evening to print. My printer is so slow. I mean, it doesn't help that I print it a lot, but it is really slow. I really don't like that printer. So, I put the pages together. I don't have any digitals in these pages. Um, they'll be covered with digitals uh, because it was printing when I was putting the pages together. So, so these are the pages. And I may throw some digitals in there. I think this, this is going to be a fat one. And there's the cover. So I was just working on the cover. I like to do my covers first. And I was just trying to figure out. I kind of think I'm going to go for this. Putting this and then this. I am, oh, and I'm using Ruby and Pearl XO, her birds kit. That's where all of these are from. And I'm also using chapter one papers and tailor made journal papers. And this blue paper here is tailor made journal. So I was thinking this, let me hold it back so we can see it. I'm thinking that, and I'm also thinking of doing some hand stitching around this. I could break out the, the sewing machine. It's packed, but I can pull it out of the box and go around it with the sewing machine. Or I can use some gold thread that my sewing machine won't take and hand stitch it. But this is the one that I'm thinking of. And then we got this, oh, which also looks good. I don't know. I wish you guys could talk to me. That looks good, kind of. Kind of washes that out some, doesn't it? That looks good. I like this one because it's bigger. It'll fill more space. Do we want that or do we want blue? I think I have some sorry silk, this blue color that I can wrap this in. I think I'm going to do the blue. And then I have this vintage wrapping paper that I'm going to use in here as well. So let's, let's do this. I think I'm going to wrap some and collage the back. Let's do this. And I 
remembered to fill my glue bottle. So I have a nice full one. I got glue all over me already. Let me see if I can spread this one out. So how is everybody doing? Our weather is not fall-like anymore. Actually, I'm going to wrap this. The top of here is a pocket, and I need to remember that it is and make a tag for it. I always forget that's a pocket. So I wanted to wrap this around both sides so we have a nice clean edge. I need paper clips. I need to move and get on pat so that I know where my paper clips are. That's what I need to do. So he is laying the floor in our bathroom today. He laid it in our bedroom yesterday. It's a slow process, let me tell you. I ordered some kitchen pools from Amazon. They were cheaper at Amazon. So, uh, they're nice black candles. So they're being delivered today. So if you hear the dog barking, that might be why. Although I'm sure Amazon won't show up while I'm filming because it's morning time and they never come in the morning. Awesome. Let's get a little vintage photo down there. I love brown with blue. Just love it. I went to Hobby Lobby yesterday and bought a couple of really pretty jars on clearance for the craft room. 
just to put buttons in or whatever. And I also bought a hook. Oh my God, a glass and iron hook. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. It was on clearance. It was gorgeous. It is gorgeous. So I think I'm gonna do some stitching on this, but maybe I'll do it off camera so you don't watch me stitch. What do you think? We have the yellow and the birds. So I do the gold and do at least the top. I guess I'll do it off camera. All right, so let's figure out. We can put these birds on the back of here. Oh, I don't like that green with the blue. I like these. After we cover that, maybe we can put those on the back or we can use this to make a tag. Nope, won't fit. All right. All right, let's see. Look, I printed out a lot of papers. And it's a mixture. These two, these are from the bird kit from Ruby and Pearl. They're a little grungy. So I'm not sure if I'll be using them. Those are not, those two. This is going to be a pocket, so we don't want that there. forget the order I have those in. Maybe we'll put that there. So yeah, our little cold snap went away. So we're back at 85, but it was 60 during the night. So that was nice. I don't think I'm gonna put that there. See, I have to take all these out, but I hope I don't forget the order I have them in. make some decisions. I don't know. Let's break this out. And I found some envelopes that I'm gonna make pockets out of that should fit in here. I don't know if I should bother trying to put this back in or not. Oh, I got it, I think. Oh, 
Oh my gosh, come on. Jeez Louise. So there's a lot here. I should cut some off so I can... Deal with this better. Use this so I get a cleaner cut. This is such nice paper. Goodness. A dog just uh, tried to get on the couch. She thought I wasn't paying attention. She's a smart dog, but not smart enough to just stay off the couch. Maybe I can put this. I am all over the place today, aren't I? I'm sorry for that. I'll put that there. Let's get this down. We made a decision. Went to Lowe's yesterday and bought some lights for this is not going in. Lights for um, my toilet area and Holly's closet and the hallway, some flat lights. And um, my husband sent me a picture. He installed an extra light that we had in the hallway. And I'm like, I just yesterday just bought lights for that. But it actually looks good, the light he put in. And it's a farmhouse style light. And it'll match the bathroom light, which it's right next to that I just ordered from Amazon this morning. So I'll probably keep that light in the hallway and take back the one I bought for it. I am, um, I'm finding really good deals on Amazon. I shop Home Depot and Lowe's. Um, 
for the house, but I've been finding really good deals at Amazon. Just a little bit of info in case anybody is uh, anybody is uh, in the market for some stuff. I got my faucets there and now my bathroom lights. Some other stuff too that I don't recall. Alright, let's see. not long enough. Can you see me? I'm go looking through papers. I want... a ledger paper. Or this. This is from um, TaylorMade Journals. It is part of a kit. I need to get the white off of here. Part of a kit that is um, handwritten. Uh, what am I looking for? the gospel, like a priest wrote his notes for his sermon notes. That's what I'm looking for. They are sermon notes. I think this was one of the first kits that I ever got from TaylorMade Journal. So what we're looking at now is Luke 2.11. I have some prayer cards that I like to add in my journals, but those are of course packed. So it was nice when I remembered that I had these sermon notes. I wish that I um, had the sermon notes in the last journal that I did because it sold to um, someone who is very faith-based. So it would have been nice to have the sermon notes or something in faith-based in the journal for her. this down. I can't wait to start making the ephemera. We'll probably make some ephemera tomorrow. Yeah, I want to say thank you very much to all of my subscribers and the sweet, sweet comments that you've been leaving. 
It's very much appreciated. I'm very humbled and thankful for the comments that you've been leaving me. And to all my new subscribers, thank you. I wonder if I should just fold that up. Make a nice clean edge. So I feel like this video is getting a bit long, so I'll probably cut it short and finish this up. Shouldn't fold that too soon. How long have we been going? 26 minutes. Let's see, what do we want to use over here? I had some papers pulled, but they're too short. So many decisions. It's rough. Got this. Should we put that there? I think this can go. Right. Maybe here, huh? Roll that over. I dropped my glue stick, sorry. So I just grabbed a new one. out of them. I love the YooHoo glue sticks, but they're not in my budget. Not as much as I use glue sticks. I buy these like a 24 pack, I think it is. A 30 pack from Amazon. And Holly uses these for school too. But yeah, I would love some Yoohoo sticks. I need some baby wipes. Oh. 
I need a lot of things today, don't I? All right, so we got that side done. What pretty paper do we want here? inside will it reach yes I wish it would rain Uh, well, I wish it would rain over here where I'm at and not at the new house. <laughs> we live on a dirt road and um, it's not maintained by the county. It's maintained by the residents. So there are, the rain causes potholes. So it's a very bumpy road. So when it rains, they fill up, which is not good. So we with a neighbor that has a tractor bought some rock just last month, some lime rock and uh, put it in. But even though we bought, you know, a good amount and it's not cheap, it wasn't enough. So it just filled just a little bit. So I love the rain. I'm definitely a rain person, but not at the new house. <laughs> So do y'all like the rain? I know some people don't. I find it soothing. This vintage photo looks so nice against this paper. I wish I could tell you whose it is, but it's one of the three that I've already told you about. Because I'm only using Ruby and Pearl's bird kit and then a variety of papers from Taylor Made Journals and Chapter One papers. All right, so we can close this pocket up now. This is a side pocket that is going to be great for um, putting all kinds of stuff in.
I'm thinking we might use that again because I used most of it inside the pocket. Oh, you know what I should have done? The gussets. Let's do the gussets. I nearly forgot. So Holly gets to wear her Halloween costume to school on Friday all day and then there's a dance as well after school so she's looking forward to that that'll be fun for her and then we have a fall festival at church on Saturday and a Halloween party that the neighborhood puts on at the neighborhood park. At the new house, there's a huge lake um, with a beach and a park. And last year was the first year that they did the, the what's it called, trunk or treat, where cars come out and have their trunks all decorated and hand out ca candy to the kids. And then they have a haunted house that they build up and put up. And it was so much fun last year. So we'll be going to that, that Saturday night. So this needs to dry. There's lots of glue on this journal right now. So I think I'm going to finish up this back side. So here's our pocket. Nice big pocket for you to put in lots of stuff and then we have this one which i think i'm gonna put a thumb hole on this side after i put the paper on so um i will finish this up let's see and then i will come back probably tomorrow hang out with you maybe make some ephemera tomorrow I love that pocket nice and big awesome so all right well thank you guys thank you so much and if you would please hit that like button and leave me a comment it can be super short and sweet but I would appreciate it very much. All right, I will see you tomorrow. Thanks guys, bye.